The carotid triangle is a portion of the anterior triangle of the neck. It is bounded posteriorly by the anterior border of sternocleidomastoid, anteroinferiorly by the superior belly of the omohyoid, superiorly by the posterior belly of the digastric muscle. Its floor is formed by parts of the thyrohyoid muscle, hyoglossus, and constrictores pharyngis medius and inferior. The major contents of the carotid triangle are common carotid artery, internal carotid artery, external carotid artery, internal jugular vein, and the last three cranial nerves. The first five branches of the external carotid artery are also present in this region. Those branches are ascending pharyngeal artery, superior thyroid artery, lingual artery, facial artery, and occipital artery. The carotid sinus is a dilated area at the base of the internal carotid artery. The internal jugular vein descends posterolateral to common and internal carotid arteries and is accompanied by deep cervical lymph nodes. We are now in a position to draw the last three cranial nerves in this region. The hypoglossal nerve descends between the internal jugular vein and internal carotid artery. Then, just above the level of greater cornu of hyoid bone, turns forwards, crossing in front of both internal carotid artery and external carotid artery, and loop off lingual artery to run on the hyoglossus muscle above the hyoid bone. The vagus nerve descends vertically downwards, first between the internal carotid artery and the internal jugular vein, and then between common carotid artery and the internal jugular vein. It gives the following two branches in the carotid triangle. The pharyngeal branch, it runs inferomedially between the external and internal carotid arteries to join the pharyngeal plexus. The superior laryngeal nerve, it runs on a deep plane, deep to both internal and external carotid arteries, where it divides into internal and external laryngeal nerves. The internal laryngeal nerve is sensory and passes forwards to disappear deep to thyrohyoid muscle. There, it pierces the thyrohyoid membrane to supply the laryngeal mucosa. It is accompanied by the superior laryngeal artery, a branch of the superior thyroid artery. The external laryngeal nerve is motor and descends to supply the inferior constrictor and cricothyroid muscles after passing deep to the superior belly of the omohyoid. The accessory nerve runs downwards and backwards across the upper part of the triangle, superficial to the internal jugular vein, to enter the sternocleidomastoid muscle which it supplies. Another nervous structure present in this region is the ansa cervicalis, which is a loop of nerves that are part of the cervical plexus. Ansa cervicalis has the following two roots. The superior root, also called descendens hypoglossi, is formed by the descending branch of the hypoglossal nerve, carrying C1 spinal nerve fibers. It descends downwards over the internal and common carotid arteries. The inferior root also called descendens cervicalis, is derived from C2 and C3 spinal nerves. As this root descends, it first winds round the internal jugular vein and then continues anteroinferiorly to join the superior root 
in front of the common carotid artery at the level of cricoid cartilage.